You're so classy. Thank so you. Classy. Your fans, you know, Prince, for yeah. goodness sake. President Obama, that's not bad. It's That'll do. It's pretty good. <laughs> so tell us a good start. How, how did that all happen? How did the whole Prince connection, how, how did that come about? Um, well, honestly, mm -hmm. he reached out to me. And ended up in your front room? Yeah. <laughs> that, that bit was more uh, spur of the moment, <laughs> I guess. Um, and he contacted me just saying, oh, I've got an idea. Wow. <laughs> and then he ended up. Uh, giving a press conference in my living room. That is fantastic because he, but yeah. he doesn't do that, Leanne. Yeah, he doesn't do things like that. No, I really. guess I feel like that's probably why he did it because he, he ah. likes to, I guess, keep people wondering mm. what he's going to do next. No, exactly. But what an amazing thing for you. Yeah, it's no, all about it's amazing. Getting, it's all about getting it's people to so listen to your music, isn't it? That's what it's all about. Yeah. Getting people to hear what, you, what you're performing and what better way to do it than that, than that way. So yeah, I know. So tell me about your mum, because you and your mum went to Jamaica, yes. Yes. and that really inspired you to, to write a, a, a lot of your music, didn't it? Um, can I just say, my mum's also called Lorraine. Ah, she! <laughs> so, yes, and, and this I... This must feel a bit odd. <laughs> no, no, it's, it's, it's very familiar. No, lovely. that's good, that's so, good, um, I like that. But yes, so my mother's side of the family is Jamaican. Yeah, yeah. And I... My, my grandfather had always promised me that he'd take me to Jamaica right. from since I was a little kid. Um, and it kind of just never happened for whatever reason. So when I had some time off finally, after doing a lot of touring for my mm. first album, my mother and I planned a trip to Fabulous. Jamaica and it was so amazing. It was really, um, I didn't realize how significant it would be until in what way? In I got what way there. well just just because my family's from there sure. I was able to 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 stand in the place where they grew up mm. and see you know where they came from all those years ago when mm. my grandparents came to oh. the UK so it was just kind of I don't know I got a bit sentimental and you know, thinking creative. about the history of it. Yeah, yes, and I was also very inspired. As well. Very much so, because yeah. you know, you, you're the kind of person that writes from the heart. Absolutely. You write about what touches you and what means a lot to you, and yeah. it's, it's it's deep and that's good. Yeah. That's why people connect with you. That's why people like Prince connect well, with you. Well, you know, that, that's, I like to think so. Yeah, of course it is. So it really did influence the, the the music. Well, yeah. I mean, when I went there, and I'm sure others that have been to Jamaica. Will, will notice that there's just music everywhere. There is, there absolutely there's like, right. yeah. there, They'll find a way mm. to put a massive pair of speakers in the jungle somewhere. <laughs> um, so you're, yeah, so you're constantly walking past loads of bass and loads of music and it was mm. amazing. And I just thought, I just thought that's what I want in my sure. life all the time, just mm. to hear music. And I also was inspired by the rhythms you know, when I think of Jamaican music, I think of, I think of syncopation yeah. and, you know, the space in the rhythm mm. that makes you want to move. So I kind of tried to inject that, I suppose, into the music I made on my second album. Uh -huh. And also I was inspired by the gorgeous flowers and... We can see that. I use that yes, on my artwork. And, and blood. Yes. We can see that in the artwork. And you do... This is all you. All of you, you know, you, yeah. you make sure that this is exactly the way you want it to be. Well, exactly. You're in I worked of it all. with an amazing um, art designer called Beautiful. Mike Lithgow, and together we kind of created this concept oh, for the artwork, just taking my experience from sure. Jamaica and Greece. And it's going so, so well. I mean, you've got this big concert at the Albert Hall coming up, which is fantastic. Yes. That is amazing. The Grammy, Grammy nominee as well. Yes. What Grammy. Grammy. A Grammy. <laughs> a Grammy. It's really good. I mean, and the only way is up. It's just getting better and better. Well, yeah. I mean, it feels amazing. And I just really, really like my job. Oh. I'm really happy that do you know what? I get to be a singer. Exactly. <laughs> it's lovely to talk to somebody who's so passionate about yeah. what they do. Thank you. Blood is obviously out now. And later on, you're going to be singing for us a track, Green and Gold. I, I am. Green yes. and Gold. Yes. I look forward to that. Thank so you. Sort of, very it's much. an acoustic version, isn't it? An acoustic? It is, yes. Ah. A little bit more intimate and stripped back. Fantastic. Leanne, thank you. Say thank hello you, Lorraine. to your mum, Lorraine. I will. <laughs> <laughs> lovely. That's really good. Thank you so, thank so much. Thank you.